All right, hello everyone, it's Happy, and today we're going to be talking about the only tank that is capable of defeating the Object 268 version 4 face to face, and that is the Hori. The Hori is a special tank because it does not exist in World of Tanks PC, it was something the Blitz developers came up with themselves, and so great applause to them. The, <clears throat> the tank is very, very interesting in regards to gameplay. Again, because the gold shells, as you all know, have a much higher penetration, but the alpha is more or less the same as in standard AP. It's a tiny bit less, like 10 to 15, I believe. And so this tank allows you to play full gold if you're rich enough, of course, and you can pretty much smack anyone and anything that moves in the game, no matter it's a mouse, an E3, whatever it is, Everything will be more or less gray and every single tank will have a weak spot if not fully gray for you. So That's the special thing about the Hori. The gun itself is also very very comfortable The only thing I don't like about the gun is the alpha which is around the 560 area And so if it was 600 it would be much much nicer, but you know it is what it is so uh, in comparison to the 6 268 version 4 uh, that thing has almost 700 alpha, and the Hori's Puny 560 doesn't really seem like a lot of alpha in comparison, of course. The mobility is also very good on the Hori, but it's not super fast like a Fosh, for example, but it's still maneuverable, and the armor is mediocre. I would not rely on the armor of this thing, and it's not necessarily the most frontline tank, even though you can play it as such. This tank is more or less suited for second... Uh, for the second line, maybe even the third line, even though camping I would not suggest in this thing, it's not like a waffle or a grill or a 268, but you could still do that. So this tank is a second or third or maybe even first line, so overall it's a very good at being able to do all types of roles, but more or less the best situation for this would definitely be behind the heavies and just act as a supporting role. So when your heavies take up the damage or soak up the damage, you can shoot them uh, you can shoot the enemy, of course, not your teammates. You can shoot the enemy after they have shot or they're reloading. And that's the best thing to do because, again, this tank doesn't have insane amounts of armor because a lot of tanks can pen it frontally very easily. And on top of that, it has not enough HP because it's a TD. And so you're going to more or less struggle if you don't know how to uh, survive in regards to saving up your hit points. But if you can do that, if you can master saving your hit points, this tank will be great because the gun is almost superb in every way except the alpha and everything else is of course mediocre, which is obviously a good sign, you know, if you have an insane gun and everything else is mediocre, then this tank is great because sometimes you'll block shells, sometimes you're very fast, sometimes you're not in comparison to other tanks, of course. And so this tank, I would give a solid 7 out of 10. So tell me what you guys think about the Hori in the comment section below. And with that, happy is out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.